Hello, welcome back. Hey, this is going to be just a little quick follow-up video um, on this um, uh, UR6QW 8-band equalizer. Uh, I didn't, I don't know exactly what pins 4 and 8 do on the microphones for a, for an ICOM. Um, and I, something has to do with audio out and something like that, so I'm not really sure, but I decided, uh, I ran it straight through and then I thought better about it and said, no, you know what, I want to, I want to change this a little bit, so... I added a couple of switches to the back. Unfortunately, I do not have a white on clear. Um, if the uh, if the guy wants it, he can get it. But basically, what this does is it's just a couple of switches so that when they're down like this, the um, eight and four pins on the mic connectors are no longer in circuit. So, and these are those little locking switches that you can't move unless you pull them up. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, but I just, I just wanted to do that so that if you wanted to use it for a Kenwood or something, you could put those switches in to, uh, to use them. And if you don't use them on ICOM or, I guess, um, maybe a Yesu, whatever, then you, you don't need them. But anyway... It works just fine. Uh, we'll hook it up over here, um, real quick to the uh, to the radio, and plug it in. And we'll listen to it on the uh, on my monitor here. Uh, on the um, communication service monitor. One, two, one, two, one, two. There we go. Turn it up enough so that it doesn't turn the echo off. There we go. One, two, three, four. Now, when I flip the switches, it doesn't seem to make any difference. However, however, I don't, uh, I don't know. I've not seen a microphone that goes with the ICOM that, that uses it, so I don't know that. I'm using this. This is a uh, MH1 um, off of an old um, Yesu, so I don't have an ICOM mic to try it with. Or do I? Wait a minute. Here's a, oh, we'll try this. Here's an ICOM HM12 off of a 471 e, yeah. Let's try this, see what this does. Okay, so eight and four are out, went well. One, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, one, two. Yeah, that works fine. One, two, one, two. And the switches in and out doesn't doesn't seem to make any difference. Yeah, so okay. Oh, so it does work. So it does work with a real ICOM microphone, and it works just fine. And that HM12, I believe, is a is, uh, uh, condenser mic. So anyhow, there we go. Last of, the, last of the little updates. Hope he likes it. Hey, thanks for watching. Till next time.